Did you know that there is a theater superstition that it is bad luck to wear blue costumes on stage? We'll just get rid of that. It's also considered bad luck to wear green costumes on stage. Ooh, ooh. That's better. Let's find out why these colors are bad luck, shall we? Hey everybody, I'm Doug Fall. This is Augmented Actor, where we help you augment your acting career with tips, tactics, and tech. Blue. There's a long-standing theater superstition that blue is considered bad luck. Anyone who wears a blue costume on stage is going to bring upon financial ruin for the theater company. Tickets won't sell, audiences will be small, the show will close early. So where does this superstition stem from? Basically back in the olden days of theater. I'm not exactly sure how old the days were, but way back then. The blue dye used to create costumes was very, very expensive. It had to be imported from foreign lands, and it was just expensive. So theater owners at the time started this superstition that it's bad luck to wear blue on stage to discourage costume designers and actors from requesting blue costumes. But some struggle theater spent their entire budget on the blue dye to make blue costumes so that they could kind of trick the public into thinking that they were a more successful theater than they actually were. It was very popular to use blue as a marketing tool back then. Most of the theaters that did this didn't spend a lot of money on sets and actors and safety and all those other things, and it showed. So if a theater had blue costumes, it usually meant that they were trying to pull something over on the general public. They were being charlatans, right? They're trying to rip you off a little bit, trying to make it seem like they're a little bit better than they actually are. And because audiences kind of saw through that ruse and stopped attending those shows, those theaters still suffered financially. So that was considered bad luck. But there is a a silver lining to this story. Silver was even more rare and more expensive to use in a costume. So if your costume had a silver lining or silver trim or silver adornments, then it showed that the theater really did have the money to make these costumes, that they had a, a, a strong financial backer or they were selling a lot of tickets and that they were in a good stable position. So if you have a blue costume with any kind of silver adornment, it's considered good luck for a theater. It means that the theater is thriving and money is flowing. So anytime you wear blue on stage, make sure you adorn it with some silver. That will give you good luck. Green. Green is a whole different story. Let me tell you about it. Ooh. Green is considered bad luck on stage because of lighting. Hmm. When the very first spotlights were introduced into theater, they burned this little cube of material called calcium oxide. It was also called quicklime, and it created this soft incandescent light that could be directed and focused, so it made a perfect spotlight, but it also cast a kind of a lime green hue, and that's where the phrase limelight came from. So whenever somebody says, step into the limelight, that's what they're referring to. So if an actor were to wear a green costume on stage under the limelight, they would virtually disappear from view, leaving the audience befuddled, causing all sorts of chaos on stage. It's kind of the same principle as green screen keying. So I'm in front of a green screen with a green shirt on. If I key out the green, then my body disappears and I'm just a floating head with a logo. Ooh, that's kind of neat. Ooh. What's going on here? Why is there a floating head? Even the makeup that actors used back in the day had a green cast to it, and they had to let it sit and cure on their face for about an hour before it actually turned skin color. And that would make their face disappear in the limelight as well. So you should never wear green on stage because it's considered bad luck. And if you disappear on stage, the show doesn't happen, all things can go wrong. It's just considered bad luck to wear green on stage. But don't tell the cast of Wicked. They don't know any better. If this theater superstition video piqued your interest, you might want to check out this playlist for more theater superstitions or you can watch this video over here for something else have a good day we'll talk to you later